So we're trying to experiment on what colors we can extract from the different plants around us. Strawberry. Here, we're working with whatever material we have available at the farm. Sometimes, the colors you see on plants does not always mean it's the same color they give out. To initially find out, you can rub the plant on your palm and observe the color you would get. These are the materials we worked with. For our mortar and pestle, we worked with coconut boughs and stones since it's what's available in the farm. And then we would need some paper, brush, and then what we have is a shot glass. Here are the plants that we worked with. The blue ternate, the bougainvillea flower, the turmeric which gave us the rich yellow color, and then the cosmos, combination of orange and yellow which gave out the orange color, and then the bougainvillea leaf, and lastly, the painted nettle leaves or the mayanas. So now, let's gather the plants. Pink and white. Okay? Mm. So here we finally have our outputs. We did this for about two hours. Feel free to experiment with other plants that you wish to find out what color they can give us. The beauty of working with natural paint is its inconsistency. You can't get exactly the same shade, so you have to settle for its uniqueness. So now let's see how it works on paper. As you can see, the color is a bit transparent. Maybe you can pound some more so that you can extract more pigments which might make your colors a little more thicker.
Here, let's try to see if combining the colors will give us the secondary color we wished or we wanted. So that's it. We hope you enjoyed watching. This is something you can always do with your kids at home. The materials are always readily available around us. Thank you for watching. Please follow us on Instagram, Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Enjoy!